Determine the lateral surface area of a right cone with a height of 5.5 centimeters. So we're given the height from here to here. The height is going to be 5.5 centimeters. Now the actual radius here is not given. It's for us to find out. So the formula for the lateral surface area, just the sides, that's all that we're interested in. We're just interested in the lateral surface area. So the area of the lateral is equals to pi r s, where s is the slant. It's the hypotenuse of this right angle triangle. Now, in order to solve this slant or the hypotenuse of this right angle triangle, we'd have to know the length of the radius. If our picture was actually to scale, we can simply use a ruler and then solve for s. However, if our picture is simply a map, if this was 5.5 kilometers, clearly 5.5 uh, kilometers would not fit onto a sheet of paper, so we'd have to figure out what scale it is so we can set up some kind of ratio. So we're trying to solve the radius, and to do so, we're gonna see how this ratio sets up here. We have 5.5 centimeters, and the ratio we're comparing it is with the actual ruler, and our ruler measures approximately uh, 7.4, or you can say, uh, 7.4 centimeters is equals to we can see here the radius of our measurement is approximately 2.9 so the some r value we'll call this r centimeters over 2.9 centimeters the denominator here for ratio is consistent it's, it's what we measure from our ruler as opposed to the numerator, which is the actual length based on the diagram. So we can now solve for r using cross multiplication. We have 5.5 times 2.9, that's multiplying this way, is equals to this number here. And then when you want to isolate r, we divide by 7.4. So this answer divided by 7.4 gives us r. So r is approximately equals to 2.16. So we have r is approximately equals to 2.16 centimeters. We'll write that in, 2.16. And now this question simply becomes a basic Pythagorean theorem question. This is our hypotenuse or our c c squared equals a squared plus b squared so c or your s value is equals to the square root of this squared plus this squared so s is equals to the square root of 5.5 squared plus 2.16 squared which approximately equals using our calculator we get s is approximately equals to 5.9 So we go back to our original question, the lateral surface area is pi r s, which is approximately equals to pi r is 2.16, s here is approximately 5.9, which gives us a final approximate answer of pi times 2.16 times 5.9 equals 40. So the final answer is approximately 40, and the closest answer we have is choice B. And the reason why we were off by a bit is because we're using an actual physical real ruler, and uh, we, there's always some measurement errors.